Notes of black cherry. Hints of jam. A distinctly robust glass of... Cabernet Sauvignon. Oaky. Full body. A dash of plum, but that's to be expected of a... Tempranillo from Chile. This is so great. We used to drink way too much beer. I'm glad we're responsible now. And drink too much wine instead. After all those years of pounding brews, I knew I had to do something healthy. Like pound wine. Wine is good for you. Antioxidants, polyphenols, grapes. I, I read an article about it one time. My aunt shared it on Facebook, so you know it's legit. I read that it can improve your memory. Really, where? I don't remember I was wasted. Remember to aerate it. Really opens up the flavors. One thing wine has taught me is that alcohol is to be savored. <sighs> Oki. Try Sophie's stick. <laughs> May I try yours? Please. Dry with a peppery finish. Zinfandel. Actually, it's a petite sera from Paso Roble. It's like we're traveling the world with our tongues. Italy. Australia. Spit bucket. There is nothing like an Argentinian Malbec and a fine cut of steak. Or a magnum bottle of whatever in this pizza I stuck in here. Good pairing. We are so mature. And world, and worldly, worldly. It's like the world is spinning, but in a healthy way, like a spin class. That is so healthy. Sleep is so important. You should get your eight hours. I am thinking about turning in myself. What's up, the world? From award holders Murph and Emily comes a new web series called Hot Date. That's right, it's gonna be coming to you weekly, and if we play our cards right, maybe we'll actually win one of these. Yes, these None are other people's. These are other people's. But we're holding them, so who's the real winner? <laughs> <laughs>